Sam. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. Hello, everybody out there here, and welcome to the next episode of The Money Vault. Hope everybody's having a great day here today, and enjoying your weekend. And, um, since we're halfway through the season, I've decided to do something a little bit special here on this episode. I decided I will be playing The Money Vault today. But for someone at home. That's right, this is a player at home edition of the Money Vault. And um, I decided to do this because why not? I decided to do this just for fun. And um, just something a little interesting here as we're halfway through the season. Um, but I will like to say I had had a hard thought about this because. I want to make this choice for this contestant fair. Because what if that certain person was to be on a future episode this season? Or what if I already had this contestant? But that would be fair, right? I would be fair equally. Well, well on this pick I decided to do... Oh, what's this? Well, before I do that, I'm gonna uh, get this up. Anyway, this contestant, I have decided to pay for this episode that I will be playing for, trying to crack a bank for a whole lot of money, is Drama Ponies. <laughs> That's right. Final one, you have been chosen to play here tonight on the Money Vault. Um, I hope you're watching out there somewhere, wherever you may be out there in the world. And I know you've been doing some great content, not game show content, but other cool content he's doing. Uh, he used to make game show content back in 2020, 2021. But in the past year or two, he's been out of the game show community for a little while now, so if you're watching out there, Dutter Bros. 501, the game show community has missed you. If you're still out doing other different things in your life as for other projects, and uh, I do respect for your decision, but you know, the game show community is a whole welcome arms if you decide to come back for 2024 or sometime in your in the future, but that is up to you, of course. Um, and the game show community has missed you, so. But I hope you sit back and relax, and enjoy this episode of the Money Vault, and see if I can help you crack the bank for a whole one cold hard cash. So, without further ado, let's begin, and let's play the Money Vault. All right, folks, it's not time to get in the Money Vault. I uh, see if I can win a lot of money for Thunderbirds 501. So let's begin with going on the left side. Let's do row, row one, number one. $29,000, okay? Let's try to put it at number mm, number mm, oh gee uh, three or four um I'm gonna go with my first gut number three now let's go to the right and let's go right in the middle for row three number three Oh ha, huh. Now let's put that in number two slot. Let's go to the left. And let's go for the very last one. Which is row number five. N number five. Ah crap, I should have put twenty nine thousand number four. But I was uh a little bit concerned. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to 
Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna swap. And I'm just gonna put the, um, so I'll put 24,000 here or 25. I'll just put it right here. 25,000. So let's go to the right and let's go with number three. Now value 5%. At two thousand three hundred dollars, no deal to that one. Let's go over here and let's go with the very nice one in one number one, number five. Another payout by you know, ten percent at four thousand six hundred dollars. No thank you to that. Let's go to the right side in number three on the first row, six thousand nine hundred dollars, which is twenty percent by built by you. No thank you. Let's try number one on the right side. Then there we go. See where this thing is. It's going to weigh up there to. Oh, $99,000. Way up there, number 10. Alright, let's go to the left and let's go to number 5 in the first row. $64,000, okay, um, let's put it in number 7, alright, let's see where we have to here for time-wise, alright, I think it's time to take a commercial break, so, me, ladies and gentlemen, will be right back after these words, don't go anywhere. Bob Fiddly Dee Bob Kearns, boom boom, what on earth is going on? Kearns bread is always on my mind! I think it's going to his head. Welcome back to the Money Vault. As you can see here on our screen, $29,000 is our bank total. Let's see if we can add more to that by going to the left side and number two on the first row. Thirty-seven thousand dollars. Okay. Now let's put that in number five. Oh, a smart way to put it there. Let's go to the left and let's go to clear out this first row with number four. And the pay up by you twenty percent at forty-nine thousand two hundred dollars. I'm gonna say no to that. And that's the number two. Let's clear out all the first rows. So guys, probably know what I'm gonna choose next. After this one, if all things go to plan, $24,000. Oh boy. I'm gonna have to pass it on this one. So the bank total is right now $246,000. And I am going to give myself an offer. Okay. Then when I keep that, oh, let me. Switch to my camera. Hold the phone. Do you want to keep that money of $246,000 for Thunder Burst 501 or try to risk it all for the rest of the way? Hmm. You know what? Since I'm doing this special episode here of giving away money to contestants out there at home, I've decided to keep it. The money of two hundred and forty six thousand dollars. <laughs> Congratulations, Anna Burns five oh one. You are walking out here with two hundred and forty six thousand dollars. 
So, I want to thank everyone for watching this episode of the Monday Pollock. I want to thank all of you for watching, and I'll see you all here next week. Bye bye, everybody. Thanks for playing the Monday Pollock. Don't forget to subscribe to the Gary Thousand Network for more great content like this one.